This year has been our first year with a parliamentary process um, being run the way we've run it with having the two parties, parliament and opposition, and it's been really, really great. At the beginning, two people will form a party and they'll run for party leaders in that party and they'll make three policies and those three policies can be to do with anything they want to change about the school. The students vote on who they want to be the party leaders. It's similar to how real parliaments work that we're trying to replicate across the college. So making sure that we have as much input from the people means that it can be the best situation for everyone. Other students can sign up to be members of parliament where they represent their home groups and those students who make it into parliament and become members, they choose which party they want to support and be on. Parliament has really um, given us a huge amount of opportunity to create a lot of events but also to tackle a lot of issues, things like um, wellness at the college, both for students and teachers, um, our interaction and relationships with our international students. Some students got the opportunity to go on ABC's Q&A. We've done Performing Arts for Carnival, which was one of the policies one of the parties wanted, so we've put that in place. At the moment, we're wor working on trying to have a real school identity. It's been really, really amazing to have the experience to really take something under my wing and um, make it happen. Through Student Parliament, I'm able to speak my voice about issues and topics that I feel and it's also helped me build better connections with the principal team and also other students from other year levels because it involves us working together to get things done. I think student voice is the most important thing in the education system.